ADSR Drum Machine 101, the brand new plugin from ADSR. I'm going to teach you today how to get the beats from the sequencer into your DAW. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to load up a kit because right now, um, oops, arm the drum machine track. You don't have anything on the drum machine yet. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to find a kit. I'm going to go with Lo-Fi Chill Hop. Now, if you look at the sequencer, we got 16 different sequences. If I turn off host, important, you can start sampling, or not sampling, that was a poorly chosen word. You can start seeing what we got here. So what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to just take beat number, let's take pattern number two. Yes, import tempo and time signature. Why not? Into the arrangement. Control D to duplicate, because I know my Ableton hotkeys. And I'll take one. And there we go. Now what happens when you press play? Now I could be playing this myself too. I mean, the track is on. But it's already done for you, right? Right? We got a beat already. I could even just go put a little extra sauce on it, like get that RC20 on it. You know what I'm saying? And then put some keys on this. There it is. There it is. And that's how you get the sequence from this to that. Like and subscribe. Peace.